Over 6 million Americans are living with Alzheimer's, and that number will continue to rise to 14 million by mid-century. The costs are really unbelievable, over a trillion dollars a year by 2050. People are living longer all over the world, which means that a lot more people are gonna be suffering from this disease, which not only threatens healthcare systems, but it's a tragedy for the person involved and for everyone around them. My dad was diagnosed with Alzheimer's about 10 years ago and recently passed away. In those last 10 years, they were very tough and it really brings home how undignified it is to have your brain basically disappearing. Well, there's a lot that we don't know about Alzheimer's. The basic molecular mechanism, what breaks down first, and therefore, what do you have to intervene with? We have to gather the data about who gets Alzheimer's, how does it get worse? Are there some things that reduce the speed of deterioration? This global research community should be able to use digital tools and cooperative organizations so that we're building on each other's knowledge because after all, solving this problem five years earlier would make such an unbelievable difference. ADDI stands for Alzheimer's Disease Data Initiative. And that's the idea to take these databases about people who got the disease and how their disease progressed and put them into a standard form we're able to access the entire patient database around the world instead of having you know, 50 of these databases where the access rules and the structure of the database means that you may not get the same type of insight that pooling these databases would provide. Yes, it'll still take brilliant humans. You know, just machine learning and the data alone is not enough, but the data is a necessary piece to have a theory of where you can intervene. And the benefits of having that treatment are hard to overstate. This is a golden age for all diseases if we organize these collaborative activities that we can get quicker insights. And you, know, you might put Alzheimer's at the top of the list of the thing that you want to take advantage of everything we know all in one place.